Well, welcome along. Um, we held an introduction to carriage diving clinic here in the Waikato recently. And as you can see, it was pretty well attended. We talked about how you can get to and from events, looked at different truck setups, different float setups, just gave some uh, assurance that you don't need to go out and buy a brand new truck. You can make what you've, what you've got work. Uh, we looked at a few floats, we also looked at a few trucks, and then Lloyd gave a demonstration of how he had set our truck up uh, with the big swinging door in the middle. So that was fantastic. We also did a mouthing session, so this is a lovely gypsy cob, uh, a youngster, who hadn't been mouthed yet, so we started that process off, and she was great, she did really, really well. Luna keeping an eye on things as always. Uh, this is one of our young ponies in our club. She came along um, as a confidence building session, started off on the long rein and by the end of the session we had her walking around the paddock uh, with no lead rein on, so that was fantastic. Uh, Stacy did really, really well. Uh, both Stacy and the pony grew in confidence, so that's all that we can ask for all that we want. Uh, over the course of the weekend we did a few harnessing up sessions and then by the end of the weekend I challenged the attendees to harness up both Henry and Bo on their own and they did a fabulous job so it was great to see that confidence grow, that understanding of how everything goes together uh, and I hope that everybody had the confidence to be able to go home and set up their own harness. Henry uh, acted as a first driven pony for the day, uh, as you can see he took a few drivers for their very first drive ever out into the dressage paddock. He's as safe as houses so I know that he's going to keep everyone safe and the smiles on everyone's faces when they came in from their first drive made it all worthwhile. You can see we buddied up the new drivers with an experienced WHDVS member just to get things going for them and then we let them out there on their own. Oh, here's Tilly. Again, keeping an eye on everything. Many thanks to Caroline who also brought Bryn along. As you can see, Bryn gave some lessons for new drivers as well and it gave me the opportunity to stand back and answer questions from the sidelines while Caroline and Bryn were out with new drivers. Bryn is fantastic for new drivers. He's very forward and very energetic and it gives them a good contrast between uh, the different types of driving ponies. Over the course of the weekend we covered off different aspects of driving, so we covered off dressage, cones, marathon obstacles, but in general it was all about understanding the basics so that people could go home and know what they needed to work on. As well as the actual driving aspect, we did cover off the different types of carriages and what would be suitable for the type of pony that they had at home. So as you can see, we're talking through the two-wheeler, we've also got the four-wheeler out, uh, and I also pulled out my project, or the Viceroy. Um, we had a look through the sheds as well, and had a look at some of the older style carriages that we've got. And then we also looked at the new modern four-wheelers that we've got for combined driving. I just want to say a big thank you to everyone that came along, everyone that supported the event and all the WHDVS members that came along and acted as uh, mentors. We managed to get a number of new members joined up to the local driving club which was fantastic and I think there's been really good feedback uh, from the event so look out for more of these in the future. I'm booked in to hold another driving clinic um, in Mukutaku in a couple of months time and I look forward to meeting you all down there as well.